Hello everyone. Let's provide a solution to the problem on the board very quickly. Let's go there. Okay, solution. Okay, so we have x root 2 equals root 12. Okay, so solve this problem, what we'll do is um, to square both sides. Okay, you can decide to square both sides. So if we do that, we'll have x root 2 to the power of 2 equals square root of 2 to the power of 2. Right? Now, from here, this square here is for both x and root 2. So to do that, we now have x squared, but then the square, the square and the root can cancel now. Then we multiply what we have here by 2. And this is equal to, sorry, this is supposed to be 12 in there. So this will now go with that. And we have just 12. To proceed from here, what do we do? We would divide this by 2 and divide the other side by 2. 2 can go with 2. And then x squared is equal to 6. But mind you, we are looking for x, not x squared, right? So what do we do? We will now square both sides again. And then remember, when you're squaring both sides, you have plus or minus. So we have um, the square of 6. To continue with this, this will go with this. And now our x is alone, and it's equal to plus or minus square root of 6. So this becomes the value of um, x. So the question is, do you think x can have two values, plus or minus? Okay, let me have your response to that in the comment section.